Hey guys, welcome back. Kyle Dimmon here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota. And today we're gonna walk you through a reflection. It's brand new to the lot, it's 2024. It's the 337 RLS. Uh, bear with me as we go around the outside. We got Highway 53 right next to us, so it might be a little noisy, but we'll get you on the outside, we'll get you inside, we'll see what you think. Starting right up front. Nice one piece fiberglass front cap, wraps around the sides, seals over here, so it kind of wraps in those corners. It's gonna be really nice to help with the structure and keeping leaks out. Uh, prep for Furion uh, side cameras. If that's something that you guys want to add, we do carry them here at Bullion, so that's prepped and ready for you to throw them on there. Up in the front storage, this is where uh, we throw the battery in the deal. Uh, 27 deep cycle marine gray batteries going in there. Really nice, good storage in there for you as well. You got a couple slides on this unit, a couple on this side, and then one on the front, so it's really going to open it up. One in the bedroom, so a lot of great space in this guy here. We'll kind of move around here. You got two 30 pound LP tanks. Again, we're going to fill those for you here at Bullion. That's part of the deal that we got. Pass-through storage in this unit is awesome. You can see the aluminum frame construction. You got heat pumped into here. A lot of great space. I'll kind of touch base more on over there, but maybe a nice spot to put an outdoor fridge. You got uh, auto level right here. You also got the tire link system on board. Also in here is your whole water bay. So what I really like about this, super easy diagram, not even I can mess it up. So you got that going on here, all your water connections, hot and cold shower. Everything's gonna fill through the bottom here and plug the hoses in so you can shut these doors and it's gonna be really clean on the inside. All your tank poles are in here as well. So we're gonna keep those from the corrosion um, of everything coming off of the road when you're traveling. So you got that going for you, which is awesome. Furion. Uh, tankless hot water heater so again endless hot showers unless you're taking scorching hot showers but you're gonna have this on board so nice endless hot showers for the team really like that feature coming around the back side again this big slide is gonna be the kitchen on the back of this rig a couple great features prep for a backup camera again we carry those at bullion for something that you want to add Yours are all set up to tow. So if you got a small trailer, small boat, maybe you're bringing something with you. Yeah, small, uh, nice 3,000 pound pitch on here with the hookups for the lights. Everything's all back here. Or if you just want to put a rack, you have a 300 pound rack. Ladder to the fully walkable roof. That's on board for you here with the Grand Design Reflection. Really like that. On the front of this unit, don't have the awnings all the way out just because of what's going on, how close they are, but wanted to show you. What I really like is this awning comes off the slide, not from behind the slide. So you don't lose any awning. It's gonna span pretty much the whole length of your camper between the two of them. So a lot of great outdoor space to give you some shade and protection from the elements. LED lights that are gonna run under all those as well. Even when, the, uh, when they're rolled up, you can turn those lights on and still get some light off of them. Right back here, you're gonna have your power and a cable connect so if you wanted to put a little outdoor entertainment section you could do that right here as well we'll skip past the stairs and we'll head up here into the nice pass-through storage again what i like about this is maybe if you want to throw a bunch of ice right here turn this into a cold beverage trough that would be great you can uh, bring all the water out there or if you wanted, there's this nice little corner section of the storage area that has power back there. So maybe buy a little mini fridge off Amazon and find something that'll fit. You can tuck that right in there as well. Slam latch baggage doors held up by magnets. Look at the thickness of those doors. Nice insulation. Grand Design is giving you some quality build right here. Really like that. This door is a friction hinge door as well, but then you do have a latch. That will hold it open if you just want to keep it open all the time. They're also throwing you a leash latch for your buddy. That's going to be right down here. So you can hook up your buddy or maybe those drunk husbands that run away. You can hook them up there keep them close to home. And then again, notice this big long awning that spans over the whole length of this section of the camper. Put the LED lights on that as well. So Another new feature on 24 are these new grab handles, which I think are pretty neat. Uh, they just kind of slide up into place. 
magnet holes them on the wall, and then they drop down and give you a hand railing the whole way up the stairs. So really like that. If you got pets, this one's coming with a Lippard screen defender that comes over the mesh. So they're not gonna bust their heads through there, go chasing the bunnies. That's gonna help keep them in the camper, keep the damage down on the rig as well. Solid step stairs to bring you in, so let's go pop in. Right as you walk in, you're gonna notice all this spacious room in here with the dual slides, the opposing sides, really opens this spot up. You got your island here, which is gonna be really great, really attracts a lot of people around it, a nice conversation piece. If you wanted to bring some stools maybe and pop them on this side, a little breakfast nook, that's a great idea. Couple new looks with the lights coming down too. I like those. Uh, you got your freestanding table and chairs and ottoman. So this guy does pop off the wall. This ottoman is removable, opens up. You can throw some storage in there, game night, extra pillows, extra blankets, anything you want to throw in here. And if you wanted to move that maybe over in front of the couch over here to kick your feet up, you can wrap one of these chairs around the side so it's not as tight when you're sitting down. But if you have more guests, you can have a four seater there, which I really like. The new colors of the 24s are these gonna be these lighter kind of brown gray looks to them. So that's a new color, kind of keep an eye out for that. You're gonna have these great pull down blackout shades. Small little features that, you know, kind of matter. You see how this is kind of hanging in the way of this window. You might want to move it, slide it to the side, full view of the window. It's kind of small little cool things like that that kind of set them aside. Theater seats that are gonna be right across the street, you know, right across the street, right across the way from the TV. Heat, massage, you come home from a long day of maybe hiking or you're out, you know, on the boat, getting whipped around on the tube. You need to rest that back. What a better spot. You kick back, turn the fireplace on. This is the spot right here. What a, what a great little spot to sit. Um, also, this section here turns into a bed. So if you have any extra friends um, who kind of surprise you, come visit you, you have a spot for them to, to sleep here. You can put about two adults on there really comfortably. There's so much storage in this unit, which is great. So you got storage up ahead of the theater seating, storage all above the couches here. So some really nice storage doors all up here. You're gonna have hidden hinges on everything. So it just looks really nice and clean. That's all on the inside, which is awesome. And then again, as you're watching this video, keep an eye on all the windows, go back. Windows everywhere, huge windows by the table, out the back. So anywhere that your camper is sitting, you're gonna have some great views. Even out the kitchen, you can kind of see some views. So really like that. JPL sound system, so speakers all throughout. Down here, bedroom, outside, different zones, Bluetoothable. You guys know how that all works. If not, we have a full orientation that goes along with any sale of our camper that's included in the deal too. So that is a great um, option for you guys. Fireplace is electric, so free heat out of that when you're plugged in, take the chill off. And then look at this, more games, extra stuff. Can't have enough storage in a camper. You're gonna have this really great pantry right next to the kitchen area. So all your goods will be right in here. And then you have this really uh, nice three burner cooktop. You know, it's not the glass top folding, but I think this one's a little nicer because I always get scared with those glass tops. This is a nice cast iron top to it. Really has that residential feel to it. Great size microwave up here as well. Even the oven is a pretty decent size on the oven, so you can really fit a lot of good stuff in there. With a small pull out drawer under it for pots and pans. Also, I don't know if you can tell in the video, we'll kind of look, there's this under lighting under the cabinet or under the countertop, which is gonna be really nice. Kind of, if it was you know a little darker, you just need a little night light, stuff like that. You got that going on. Under the sink, spot for a garbage can. And I mean, once you get in a grand design and really start opening the cabinets and you know touching all the drawers and pulling those open, you can just really feel the quality in these guys. So you're gonna have to see one for yourself. Uh, nice drawers right next to the kitchen. 
power down here as well. So, and then there's power on like both sides of this island. So just good plugins everywhere. 16 cubic foot fridge and freezer in here. You can really fill a ton of food for a nice long weekend. And then I love this little coffee bar setup. So if it, you know, whether it's a coffee bar, the adult beverage bar, crock pot bar, you want to put, um, you know, maybe a taco bar over here. I mean, options are endless. You guys do whatever you like to do, but a nice space over here. Um, you got plugins on the wall for everything you need. You got USB plugs right above, so you can put all your devices up here, kind of keep them in a nice catch-all one spot there, keep all the cords tucked in the back. And then you got all the cabinets up above here as well. This unit has two AC units and one max air fan. So you have a max air fan in here, really moves some water, got the rain sensor. So if it starts raining, you guys are away from the unit, that'll just close, so that's gonna be really nice. You're not gonna have to worry about that. The one AC in here is all ducted throughout. Um, I want you to also kind of, we can point out too, that there's no carpet in this unit. So keep an eye on that. They've moved to the linoleum side, so a lot of, um, keeping those smells and dirt and grime and stuff out of here really easy to clean on the floors. Moving up, so this is going to be a thermostat and the max air fan controller right here. So for the main section, the bathroom, porcelain toilet in grand design, a lot of great cabinetry in here, you can fit all the towels, everything you're going to need, nice towel hanger, a little fan. A nice shower, this does not have a skylight. It has a little push puck light. So, still gives you a little bit of headroom, um, but you know, at night, let's say you're taking a shower at night and you want a little light in here. I kinda like that, that's new. Way to go, Grand Design. Chair in here, really nice one piece tub surround, so you're gonna have to just feel the quality of that again. Nice head shower piece, glass doors on here. It's a great bathroom. A lot of good counter space. Your hot water is all going to be in here. Storage, medicine cabinet. So, nice bathroom. Moving to the bedroom. Again, this is that one of those slides. Uh, so you got a queen bed in here with the slide out. Windows on both sides are going to open. You also have power USB on both sides towards the ground. Like I said, you got a speaker in your bedroom, so you can kind of bring that back here. Another AC that is wall mounted thermostat. So that'll just kick on and off. You don't gotta turn it on and off from up here to just cold or this. You can set a temperature. Once it gets there, it'll kick down. So nice feature, not getting up in the middle of the night to turn it on colder, turn it a little hotter, shut it off. Thermostat on the side of the wall is, is awesome. Really nice dresser with drawers and, and um, storage up above it. But again, once you get in these grand designs and start pulling these drawers open and just feel how smooth they open, the quality of them, the durability of them, they're awesome. Open up the windows, cross ventilation in here. Look at this closet. I mean, the thing is huge. You walk in, you got the drop right here so you can walk in, get to everything. It is prepped for a washer dryer. So if you wanted to put those in here, again, we carry those here at Bullion so we can take care of you on that aspect. Watch your head, it's a little short, um, but to be expected up in the camper. But I mean, the size of this closet is amazing. You kind of you want to poke in there, hanging, hanging all your clothes, shoes, foldables, hoodies, sweatpants. I mean, store your suitcases, everything right in there. And then if that's not enough storage, you do have up under the bed to throw a lot of extra stuff in there too. So. Just an awesome bedroom in this unit. Um, with the queen bed, it really makes it feel a lot bigger too. So I think that's all we have for you. Again, my name is Kyle Dittman. I'm here at Bullion RV. I'd love to work with you, help you out. I am in sales. So give me a call at 218-740-4964. Smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, help us grow our channel and help you see the videos as fast as we make them. So thanks again for watching and have a great day.